time for another Dollar Tree Haul. Alright guys, let's get into this bag. I did use one of the recyclable bags from, I think this is Epicure. No, yeah, Epicure bag. It's really heavy duty. I like these type of bags. So if you want to save a buck, take your own bags into the dollar, dollar store, Dollar Tree, and also save the environment. So I ended up picking a few snacks up. I'll show you in this bag there are just snacks and paint. If you're not into this video, it's okay. We'll see you next time at another video. If you want to stick around and check out these paints, stick around. We're going to get into it. All right. Yummy. Some ranch crispers. Just a fun little snack. Now, one thing I um, didn't look at, though, was the date. Be careful when you buy products like food from the Dollar Tree. Sometimes they're out of date. Like this, it is April 29th right now. Um, yeah, so it is out of date. There is a couple of them I did notice that were out of date. So just be careful. This one's due next month. Seeds. And this one's okay. 2022. We still got time for that. Some yummy honey roasted peanuts. These are cute like for just like snacking on or just travel size if you're going anywhere. This one is really out of date. Guys, it's 2021. Yeah. That's kind of gross. I didn't see that till I got home. So keep an eye on the date on the back when you go shopping. So I'm sure they'll probably still be okay, but still, a store shouldn't sell outdated food. FYI. And this one, there we go. These are pretty yummy though. They still feel soft, so that should be okay. I've never tried these. If you guys have tried them, let me know what you think. So, I'm going to try those out. Froggies. Leaping froggies. Those ones are okay till next year. Another package of those wreaths. And then I got these little bars. I've never tried these little bars either. They look good. Got a little bit of time yet for we eat those. Got another bar. And then I found these little, they're uh, just seasonings for your popcorn. They do have other scents, or seasonings like barbecue and, I don't know, I, I think ketchup is the other one. But I only picked up one sour cream and chives and then three salt and vinegar. So you just make your popcorn and then you just toss this on and you have flavored popcorn. So we're going to give this a try and I hope it tastes good. And then I like doing cards. Like I like making my own birthday, anniversary, wedding cards. These were pretty cute. There's envelopes, eight envelopes and eight cards in in here. So maybe stick around and we can decorate some cards together. All right, here's the paint. There's tons of paint in here. If you want to stick around and watch that, you're welcome to. If not, then... That's okay. Let's move all this over here. That was snacks. And crafts. Alright, so here we have leaf green paint. Now, a lot of these I picked up a couple of them because the bottles aren't very big. But they still... 
Yeah, they're they're really good paint for acrylic paints. They're really good. And if you find them too thick, just add some water to them and then it'll it'll get you a lot farther with the paints in these bottles. So what what have I been doing with paints like that is I bought these containers on Amazon. You can find that video and the link provided if you're interested in purchasing these bottles. I have been using them quite often and I really do like them. So if you want to check out that review um, of these bottles and where to get them, I actually want to purchase some more of these. In that video I wasn't quite sure if I was going to like them, but here's my honest review right now. I like them. They are really, really good quality and so I fit about three to four, sometimes maybe even five bottles into one of these bottles. So just a great little tip if you want to purchase your paints from Dollar Tree instead of some expensive craft store because I found, let me give you another idea. Now I think, okay, so this was from Michael's and I think they were on sale for around 16 bucks. Regularly, I believe they're around $22 or $25. If I calculated it out right, uh, I think it takes around eight of these in here. And this is still a lot cheaper to buy at $1.50 a piece than it is to buy one of these. Plus, I don't think this is as thick. It's just a more flow acrylic. That's just what I have discovered. But if you if you don't want to mess around with all these little bottles, then just go to Michael's and buy the big big paint bottle. They don't have as many big like they don't have as many colors in the big bottles. So that's why I like to stick to Dollar Tree because then you can have so many different colors of paints. Last time I went, I couldn't find black. They didn't have it. And then this time, they were more out of the neons. So it's a hit and miss. So I did buy quite a few of the blacks. Here we just got some neon orange. One of the few of the neon ones. I got some silver metallic. Cobalt blue. A couple of those. Navy blue. Teal. Pacific blue. Tutti Fruity, Majestic Purple, and Gold. So I got a few of the Golds, Fuchsia Fun, this is the Tutti Fruity, Tuscan Red, Cotton Candy, I know I got a few of the cotton candies. This is the warm beige, another black, the burnt umber, again a silver, tropical green, neon green, deep turquoise again, navy blue. And I did pick up some whites. Sunny yellow, cotton candy. This is pine green, another pine green. Black, silver, teal, lavender. Keep it up. Leaf green, another neon green, silver. What's this? Neon pink, Kissimmee. This is wild eggplant. That's a pretty color. We have neon red, pumpkin orange, wild eggplant again, white, pink, the fuchsia pink. We have a warm beige, Tuscan red, black, fuchsia. Neon red, tropical green, butter yellow. They didn't have a lot of those around. 
These are fun, the neon reds. This is a sunny yellow. Pumpkin, again, orange. More gold. Wild eggplant again. A couple more. Majestic and burnt umber. All right, one more paint. Same thing, Tuscan red. One last thing, I picked up these paint brushes. They're just a chunky brush. There's three of them in here. These are green burr. Hmm. Cool. I don't know. They looked they looked plastic, which they are. But I think this would be nice for like a rub painting. Let's they've got really firm bristles. So you can hear it. Yeah. That'd be good for like scratch art almost. So cute little paint brushes, so I'm gonna try those out. I know they look cheap, but they seem like they're pretty good quality. I can't believe I went to one store and for one paintbrush, like almost sixty dollars. Holy crap, that's expensive. Find what you want to use and it doesn't have to be that expensive really to do the job. But Ta -da! There's the paint haul, guys. You can see it all? And snacks. So, oh, is there one? There's two still in here. <laughs> God, I thought I had them all out. Tuscan and black. Tuscan red and black. Okay, there we go. Thanks for sticking around the Dollar Tree haul. If you enjoyed, please give it a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe for the next Dollar Tree haul. Check out my Dollarama hauls and a lot more also with product reviews, crafts, and much more. So, yeah, time to get crafting. Okay, we'll see you later, guys. Bye.